In this segment of Get Back to the Gear, we're going to go over our entire shorts lineup. First and foremost, we're going to go over the fabrics. We have three main fabrics that our shorts are made out of. And then we're going to loosely go over the designs and cover uh, what they're great for and kind of what the story is behind the design. Um, so to start out with the fabrics, we have our, um, our GT fabric. These were uh, introduced uh, in the Paladin GT Foundry project. Um, it was an extremely well-received project. I think we did like 230 um, percent when we when we ran that project. So this is hopefully something that we're going to introduce in the lineup eventually. Um, but it's a GT fabric, so it's 97 percent um, nylon, 7 percent uh, elastane, or 90. I'm sorry, 93 percent nylon, 7 percent elastane. So what that gives you is it gives you a really lightweight, highly packable. Um, uh, fabric that is a two-way stretch. This is our most lightweight fabric in our shorts to date. And I'll just show you an example of how packable these things are. You can ball them up and hold them in the ball of your hand or the fist of your hand there. So um, that's our most lightweight fabric. And again, those are in our Paladins. And we'll go over the design story with those in a minute. Going into probably the brunt of our shorts is our AC fabric, our amphibious cloth. It's 100% nylon. Um, it's DWR treated, so when you get it from us, it's going to have a, a lot of water repelliency, but once that wears out, you can easily retreat it. Um, they dry exceptionally fast, they breathe exceptionally well, and they're very lightweight. Not quite as lightweight as the GT fabric, but easily still one of the most lightweight fabrics that we offer in our complete lineup. And so that's in our Tritons, our Talons, our Force Tens, and our Recons. And then rounding out the fabric lineup in our shorts, we have our Ripstop, um, or RS, if you see it on our site. It's a 50-50 nylon cotton blend, and it's in that um, mil-spec gridded uh, Ripstop fabric. It might be hard to see on the coloring here. Um, but this is really primarily meant for heavier field use, not quite as lightweight as the AC or the GT, um, but certainly will take a beating in the field and will last an exceptionally long time in heavy abuse use cases. So that's the lineup in terms of fabric. What we're going to do now is kind of go over the design stories of these shorts. And right now we kind of have them layered from high activity um, all the way down to more casual wear, if you will, or street wear. So starting, starting with our Paladin GTs, these were our, our, our first entry into more sports wear in terms of high activity, working out, trail running, um, high intensity workouts like CrossFit, uh, things of that nature. Um, so they have a nice elastic waistband, um, they have a nice drawstring, extremely minimal pocketing. You have one main pocket here that has a little uh, hang, hang cord in it to secure your valuables there. So those are the Paladins. Again, really meant for, um, for extreme mobility and, and high output. So working out things of that nature. Then moving into our Tritons. Tritons are our kind of all around uh, amphibious adventure uh, short. So this is something that's gonna work great for going to the beach, uh, kayaking, canyoneering, uh, things that are gonna be in high, high heat and most likely very wet. Um, they will certainly work in high heat, dry climates, but we would most likely recommend something like the Force Tens or the Recons uh, in, in that environment. So these are gonna have a, an included uh, belt you have some uh, pretty unique pocketing on the left and right side to retain different tools, reinforcements in the pockets. Uh, you have a zipper fly. They're going to be one of the shorter inseam shorts, uh, again, to kind of give you that mobility in the field as you need it. So again, Tritons are more for uh, big adventure, outdoor, high heat, and uh, a lot of water or, uh, or if you plan to come across a lot of uh, aquatic environments. Next in the lineup, we have the Talon Guide Short. So this is a mix of AC and Tweave. The Tweave is the reinforcement down here on the bottom uh, towards the knees and then on the seat. That does two things. One acts as super uh, abrasion resistant material on top of the AC as well as gives you a lot of stretch mobility. You'll notice there's no rear pocketing on these. Um, you have two standard pockets on the front 
and then uh, these uh, small little angled cargo pockets. Those are specifically angled for uh, if you were to wear a climbing harness, it would fit uh, perfectly so you could still access those cargo pockets. This is for more uh, kind of generalized outdoor adventure, but still in the realm of uh, big mobility. So things like uh, mountain biking, rock climbing, whether it be with or without a harness, um, if you're doing some uh, some like uh, spring or summer uh, mountain uh, uh, summiting or mountaineering in the terms of uh, just you know going up to a summit non-technical climbing um, these would work great for that so the main difference between these and the tritons being the tritons are really built, built for um, high mobility in high heat and extremely aquatic the tritons um, excuse me the talons are really built for uh, a lot of mobility but uh, could be anything from moderate climate to hot climate and things that you would want a little bit of extra abrasion and strategic pocketing in. That brings us to kind of the tried and true middle of the road. Um, this is our Force 10 AC cargo shorts. So just like our standard Force 10 design, big cargo pockets, uh, you have a ton of storage in these. They are drained, or the, I'm sorry, they do have holes for drainage in all the pocketing. Um, so they're going to drain well. Um, they're, again, made out of AC, so they're lightweight. And these are kind of, again, the middle of the road. They're going to work great for just doing simple summer activities like working in the garden, mowing the lawn. Conversely, they'll do great on a hike or kayaking, going to the beach, something like that. But generalized middle of the road, lots of storage, lots, lots of pocketing, kind of, um, uh, master, of master of none, uh, jack of all trades. So that's our Force 10. Then going down into a little bit more low profile, again, a lot of storage, but more low profile, something that works uh, more in the uh, urban environment or street environment are our Recon AC shorts. Again, AC fabric, nice and lightweight, highly breathable, uh, dries fast, but you have, uh, again, uh, the, the cargo pockets like the Force 10s, but these are gonna be a little bit more low profile, um, not so uh, noticeable if you're out on the street. You still have a lot of storage in the rear and hidden in the pockets uh, up here up front. Uh, again, the traditional uh, reinforcements here. So again, these are more for, uh, you're gonna uh, you know, go, go down to the brewery on a nice uh, hot summer day. Um, something that's just a little bit more streetable, doesn't look so technical. That's where the recon uh, really come in or the recon ACs really come in. And then take some of those designs and then just roll them over into the uh, RS material. So we just got done talking about the Recon AC. These are the Recon RS. No change in design other than it is in our RS fabric. So what that does for you gives you a different color options, gives you a different density. So these, um, if your office environment allows you to wear shorts or if it's a little bit more uh, of a dress up environment, say a family barbecue or something like that, uh, you're going to want to go with the RS or if you're going to do a lot of field um, field type of uh, activities where it might not be an extreme high heat uh, climates that you would want the AC in but it would still be climates that you'd want some uh, robustness in the fabric say overlanding summer camping things of that nature that's where the recon RS's really come into play uh, we don't have an example here, but there's also Force 10 RS, and again, same story, kind of middle of the road, jack of all traits, big cargo pockets, um, same in the in the RS fabric there. And then rounding out the collection are the Icon RS shorts. These are our most low profile in terms of look. Um, they only come in the RS, the ripstop fabric, right now. And these are just a very nice, clean pair of shorts. You have strategic reinforcements, um, button, uh, button closure, zipper fly, and then you have some hidden pocketing uh, coming down here on the sides of the shorts, as well as this yoke pocket, and then you have your traditional back pocket. Again, these are, uh, if you don't want to wear cargo pants in a more streetable environment or urban environment, um, but you do want to have storage, the ability to carry extra things like spare mags or um, a, uh, a med kit or whatever, whatever your EDC or use case may be, that's where the icons come in. So these are, again, our most clean, sleek pair of shorts, easily streetable, work great for just general every day uh, on a hot day around the city. They look great. 
So that's our general lineup of all of our shorts, again, ranging from the different fabrics to the different designs. And we hope that helps you out.